Hey guys, we have a table given here, EMP department, and this table has two columns, EMP ID and department ID. So you need to delete all the records from this table, except the employees, which are having department ID 21 and 23. So basically deleting is not a big deal, but I'm going to talk about a trick which can be useful in your project. So first let's find out how many distinct department ID is there so that we can just use the department ID to delete from this table. So we have this department IDs, right? So in order to delete from this table, we need to write something like delete from the table name, which is employee department, department ID, okay, not in. But what if the total number of department IDs is not to it, let's say it is more than 50, then what you can do? So have to convert your department IDs uh, from here into comma separated, okay? So let's see how you can do it. String aggregate, okay? So this takes uh, two parameters. So the first one will be your department ID. And second one will be and how you want to concatenate it okay? i want to create a string which is separated by comma okay so i will supply like this but here is a problem guys it will give you all the department ids not only the distinct one if you see it, it has given all the hundred department id so how can we find out the distinct you cannot apply distinct here because uh, this function does not support the distinct okay so you have to use a sub query okay? so let's call this as department aggregate okay and then here we can write from and then we can do select distinct here we can use distinct okay so department id from what is your table name your table name is this right so let's remove this from so it should be fine let's name this query as q if you execute it you should be getting the distinct department aggregate okay so now you can copy and paste it from here to here so the point is how you can convert your column result into comma separated string 